welcome back to my channel as you can tell from the title of this video this video is going to be a video on how i prepare my hair for my wigs um i know it's probably like girl you really got hair but i know but like i still have to do it but um this hair is from Rishon. hair comes in a plain white box like this like when the wig got here i was like who hair is this because i review so much i was like who sent this hair i don't know who sent this hair then they finally reached out to me was like did you get the hair and i was like yeah i got the hair but um i just love this hair on me you guys like i just love this hair before i get into all that so I just want to say thank you so much for everyone who has been subscribing to my channel, who has been supporting me, because we really came, came we really, are, we, we are really coming a long way. Like, we're gonna be at 100k. I feel like that is so crazy. Like, you at 100k? Really? Really? You know what I'm saying? So yeah, but enough me talking. Let me just get into the video and show you guys how I prepare my hair and how I get my wig looking like this. So yeah. Okay, so as you guys can see, my hair is looking a hot mess. But I had a bun, so I'm gonna be doing taking my bun out and all that stuff. So yeah. So after I take my um ponytail holders out and all that stuff, I'm gonna be scratching my head, y'all. My head itches so freaking bad. Like it was itching so bad. But after I finished um scratching and stuff, I tried to comb it, but as y'all can see, I can't comb through gel and all that stuff. So this goes for anyone. Before you even try to do your hair, make sure you wet it up because your hair will break off and you don't want your hair to be breaking off. So I'm gonna just be tangling i'm finna be detangling my i'm finna wait i'm finna go through and detangle my hair and y'all y'all see that blonde spot on my hair i was like what is that but yeah besides the point After I finish the tangle, I'll be going in with my little hair growth stuff that I've been using. Um, and I feel so bad that I can't tell y'all where I got it from because to be honest, it was in a sponsorship and I lost everything. Like my email is so full. So I really lost everything. But I'm just gonna um go through and just put that all through my hair. And I I'll be um looking at my comments, I'll be like, oh my god, your hair is growing. I don't really see it. Like I can see it's growing. But, you know, like, I guess. But make sure you put your oil, if you're going to do the steps, make sure you put your oil on your edges. Because I wear a lot of lace fronts, and I don't want my edges disappearing, you know what I'm saying? So now what I'm doing is combing through my hair again. It makes it easy for me to comb through since it's oil in there and all that. And I must go through and massage my scalp, too, because I feel like, oh, why not? After I finish massaging my scalp, I'm going to go through my hair with this comb, and I'm going to part straight down the middle of my head um basically what the steps like i'm not even trying to make this video complicated what i'm doing is i'm going to be doing a slip back to my hair because that's the only way i know how to get my hair straight um so you can do braids and all that but me personally i like to wear my real hair out too so i really don't want to wear braids all the time that's just like why you know what i'm saying i don't wear wigs all the time i like to wear my real hair sometimes too so yeah i'm just gonna be you know detangling and gelling This step is optional, but for me, I go in with these steps because sometimes my hair like to come up. I'm using got to be glued. I'm going to use the freeze blast on my hair. I'm using the gel just to like, you know, just make sure it holds my hair down because sometimes it comes up. Um, Another tip I want to tell you guys, when you're using this stuff, let it dry on your hair first. Don't put that on and put the cap straight on because you're basically going to mold the cap to your hair. Don't do that. I have did that before. Now I'm doing is brushing my edges and making sure everything is going to be covered and all that stuff because you don't want your edges getting stuck up in your lace. But me, my edges come down so far, so I have to put my wigs down farther and it still be on my edges. You know what I'm saying? So I just be like, whatever. Now I'm going to go on my freeze blast. I'm spraying it on my hand, not directly to my head. And I'm going to let that sit. And then I'm going to come back. And I'm going to be putting my um wig caps on. After I let that dry, I'm going to go on with two wig caps. Um, I used the black one first. Usually my black one usually be a little tighter. But I had, um got a new cap because I lost the one I always use. 
So I put the black one on, and after I put the black one on, I'm gonna go in with the, the um tan one because that makes it like the you know like when you look at your legs, you can see the color. So yeah, I used I used to just use the black caps, but then I started using two caps, and I feel like my hair holds way better with two caps than one cap. So after I have my caps on, I will be applying this wig, and this wig is from Reshine Hair. If you guys didn't know, this hair is bomb as if y'all like. If y'all don't know you know now because the hair is bomb and all everything we need we in the link down below like that's the best hair i ever got to be honest like curly wise and it's a 14 inch and the curls look natural it's just like a natural look like y'all i got it on right now like it's my favorite wig so far after i get my straps adjusted i'll be putting the wig on i'm not gonna um do a voice over me putting the wig on because i have so many videos like literally so many videos of me showing you guys how to put a wig on how to install a wig and all that stuff so i'm just gonna fast forward through me putting my wig on and all that stuff because i feel like it's no point i always show y'all me putting i'm still showing y'all but i'm not gonna talk through it Okay, you guys, you have made it to the end of this video. I know I didn't show you guys me doing my edges and all that stuff, but I was like, the wig, I mean, this video really isn't about that. It's about me showing you guys how I make my wigs look natural and how I apply my wigs and how I prepare my hair up under. Um, Basically, that's really all I do. I don't have a lot of hair like most people, so all I have to do is... um slick it down slick it back all that stuff and put two wig caps on because my hair is a little thick so that's what i do once again this hair is from Rishai hair if you like this hair because everybody been saying this hair look natural on me where you get it from where you get it from um oh yeah and i also did cut it in the video to make it like a little bit shorter because it is a 14 inch but i want it to be a little bit shorter you know so yeah and also this hair is bomb and also everything you need you can link down below i just had like a brain fart but um anyways you guys if you're not subscribed to my channel Hit the red subscribe button down below and also if you're not following me on my social medias i'll put all my social medias up on the screen right there because everybody else on my social media so why don't you and i will see you guys in the next video and i love you guys bye